Welcome back to the Business Psychology Hub channel. This is part two of the video looking at decision making theorists and if they were a rap star, who would they be? What we're going to do now is look at a true decision making superstar. The German Gerd Gigerenza is one of the modern great decision making theorists. He's also a highly skilled jazz musician and banjo player. His body of work has examined how humans make decisions with limited time and knowledge. While fellow great decision-making theorists Kahneman and Tversky describe rule of thumb heuristics as being human biases, Giga Renza concludes that in a world where decisions must be made under conditions of limited time and knowledge, that having a collection of heuristics to apply to key problems is the key to success. Giga Renza describes the repertoire of heuristics that an individual or institution has at their disposal as being their adaptive toolbox. The adaptive toolbox are a set of decision rules and heuristics that are described as being as essential for everyday living. We draw upon our adaptive toolbox to make quick decisions to solve everyday problems with low levels of cognitive and mental effort. And the greater our adaptive toolbox, and the more that we can mix and match heuristics to solve problems, the greater our levels of creativity. Giga Renza developed the concept of the adaptive toolbox by drawing on the work of Herbert Simon and his concepts of bounded rationality and satisficing. I'm drawing a parallel between Gerd Giga Renza and the superstar rapper Biggie Smalls. Biggie Smalls and Giga Renza have both re-established the prominence of cultures that gave birth to their discipline. The field of decision-making psychology was originally developed in Germany about 140 years ago. When Hitler came to power, many of the greatest minds fled Germany, and the epicenter for great decision-making theorists was in the United States of America and Israel. Through the work of Gergi Gorenza, Germany has once again established itself as one of the great decision-making centers. The original great rappers such as Grandmaster Flash came from the east coast of the United States. But by the mid-1990s, through the work of legends such as Dr. Dre, Ice Cube and Tupac, the epicenter of rap had moved to the west coast of the United States. But Biggie Smalls produced a series of masterpieces and became the leader of a rap culture that re-established itself as one of the epicenters of rap music. Biggie Small's rap style also gives an example of how mastery can be achieved through the adaptive toolbox. Biggie Small's developed heuristics to master nearly all the elements of rap including flow, structure, rhyming pattern, voice and tone, and poetry. Biggie Small's developed an adaptive toolbox with heuristics that allowed him to master the different components of rap so well that he could, without writing anything down, interweave multiple rhymes on top of each other while keeping a smooth lyrical flow. This resulted in masterpiece songs. An understanding of how to use heuristics in the workplace can also be the basis of job-related mastery. That is, to use the right decision rules and heuristics in the workplace to make quick decisions with low levels of mental effort. This is the end of part two of this video. To see which decision theorist is associated with Jay-Z, click on part three of this video. If you're